Well, hey guys, welcome back to Obi Outdoors. Well, we got a different episode today because uh, we're heading out on Lake Winnebago. We got the permanent shack behind us right now, and uh, we're going to head out a few miles and spend the night in it. So stay tuned. We're going to be hooked up shortly. Oh, here he comes. He's screaming. Look at that. Now that is a definition of a jumble. We got ourselves our first uh, keeper eye. That is a decent crappie right there. I'll definitely be marking this one now as a success. Alright, TV's hooked up, antenna's on. Let's see what this little 12 volt's gonna pick up out here. Oh, that's not bad, 24 channels. Uh, I went down uh, about seven though, uh, since last year. So I don't know what's going on with that. Maybe it's just the area that I'm at right now, but hey, we'll take it. There's a fish on here. All right, guys, here we go. We're gonna, we got a nice fish on here right now. There's a nice water right there. All right, look at that, guys. That is a perfect keeper eye right there. Look at that. All right, that is what we wanted. All right, guys, well, sitting here watching my movie and all of a sudden I heard the rattle real click one time. All right, lifted it up a little bit, felt some tension on there, and I knew there was a fish on there. Didn't know it was gonna be a nice eater like this one, but uh, hey, you know, it's almost 10 o'clock and we're putting eyes on the ice. If you ever hear there's not a night bite on the Lake Winnebago system, well, here's your proof right here. Nice, nice eye, all right. So, uh, well, what's gonna go on here, I'm gonna put another minnow on and, uh, Drop this bag down. Just inhaled it. <sighs> Drop this bag down and uh, I'm gonna get back to my movie. What's a night in the ice shack without some venison dogs? So we're gonna get the grill going here and uh, have ourselves some supper. Nothing makes a Venny dog taste better than being out in the middle of Lake Winnebago and eating it off your grill inside your ice shanty.
do we got? Mighty whitey. Corner of the mouth, right there, just like we want. Sure it's fun waking up to those rattle rails popping, I can tell you that. smoke both rattle reels. Unreal. I gotta clean up all this line out of here from you. There you go. Oh no. And my other rattle reel. Alright guys, well successful night out here in the sleeper on uh, Winnebago. Um, wanted to get you guys a video to show you a little bit of how I have everything set up when I sleep out here. Um, one bigger reason is because Battle on Bagel uh, is coming pretty soon here. It's actually next weekend. And, uh, you know, you're able to fish throughout the night on that. And, well, I've heard a lot of people saying there's not a night bite. And there is. And the proof is in the pudding. So, hopefully this uh, will uh, give you a few little tidbits of information to help you put a few more fish on the ice for the tournament. Uh, they've got some great prizes this year. Two trucks and two boats. Uh, it's hard to beat on that. You'd be sitting pretty darn good if... Uh, you're able to hook up to one of those or jump into one of those. So, <clears throat> um, I got a, quite a bit of things to pick up and uh, pack up before I head back to launch. But, uh, you know, we definitely uh, came out successful. We got a nice eye last night. Um, and then the white bass were just going nuts since 3 a.m. All right, the rattle reel right over here, uh, that one was just this at 3 a.m., that was just on fire. I ultimately took that up because I was just wasting my TRS minnows here on uh, white bass. About 7 a.m. this one started lighting up and uh, I got a little bit of film of that one but uh, those are all white bass too so uh, I guess uh, we're gonna pack up though and head back to launch I mean there's definitely fun to be had out in the sleeper here on the Winnebago system so if you guys like what you saw though please click that subscribe button that's on your screen there um, or if uh, you're viewing me from a different player other than YouTube uh, you can type in that URL that's at the bottom of your page here, and uh, that'll take you to my YouTube channel. You know, I guess uh, I guess that's going to do it for me, though. So uh, until next time, tight lines, stay dry.